Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with a new video today. Today's gonna be a really quick video that I just wanted to get in up for you guys. Um, I made a recent trip to Daiso actually on Friday, right before 4th of July came around. So just really recently, about a week ago, once you're seeing this video. Um, and I just wanted to quickly share the things that I got from there right before I started putting them away because I've been like holding it off just to kind of like, I don't know, I was like, I was going to start putting everything away and I'm like, why not just film a quick video you guys, really quickly, really random haul. So let's just jump right in. I did end up getting, I actually just came back from taking my son to take his six month um, pictures, his half birthday pictures. Um, if you did watch my vlog that just went up this week, you've seen that we were shopping for his outfits. So I did half of them 4th of July even though it's kind of a few days later, but since it was in July, I figured why not do some 4th of July theme pictures. So I ended up getting these, which one's missing because I used the other one to take as a prop for my son. So I ended up using these, um, what are they called? Pinwheels. I like totally forgot the name for them. Like the ones you like blow on them, they like swirl around. So I got these pinwheels at Daiso. I thought they were really cute. They had really cute 4th of July stuff for you to, um, like, for if you're going to barbecue or have, like, a party or anything. They had really cute stuff to, like, decorate. So I got those, and then I also got, I took it out of the bag already, and I took it with me. It was, like, a little banner, like, the little, like, triangle flags of the American flag to take to put on the background for him, for his picture. So I also got that at Daiso. And then I ended up getting this. This was the main reason why I wanted to go to Daiso. It is like this little container, um, rectangular with like little like crochet type of shape. Obviously it's not crochet material, but like the cutouts, it's kind of like the crochet kind of looking. I wanted to get these to put my ColourPop um, eyeshadows in here so I could put them on my, my little like wherever I keep my makeup. Um, so I wanted to get this to organize my eyeshadows because I have all my ColourPop eyeshadows still in like the box where they ship them to me because I don't want them to get like all like lost and mixed in with the other ones that I have. So I bought this so I could put them in here. So I got it in beige because of course I love, it's like a pearly color. I love my room like I love it to be gold and white. So that's why I got this color. They have like a few other colors. And then I got these eyelashes from Daiso they have like a wide variety of like a huge range of like eyeshadows and I got I don't know why this brand kind of just caught my eye their eyelash I got these three pack three different packs I did wear these already as you can see they're like with glue on them and like I took them out so I wore these and then I got these other two which is like I don't know green and red I guess a like different sh um different um like lashes, like more dramatic. These are a little bit more like doll dramatic eyelashes. And then these are a little bit more, I guess also, but like a little bit more not as like elongated as the red ones. And then these that I wore, I think are like the most kind of in a way natural looking, but like with volume. And I wore these and so far I really like them. Obviously they do come with the glue, but I use my own. Uh, glues because I have the black adhesive so I use my own glue but I mean so far I really like them and like they're a little bit obviously like the like um the strip is not like the best quality like I was kind of like scared when I was like taking it out of you know the little white thing where they're they come like glued on but they were good like I really like them they lasted the whole day they didn't like feel heavy or anything they felt pretty natural so I really did like them I think if I once I wear these and I really like them I'm gonna go back for more so I got those and then I ended up getting a simple container for my soap because I don't even know if my husband still uses a soap bar keeps a bar of soap on the sink in the restroom because he washes his beard and it's just like sitting there and it like irritates me just seeing it there like without anything so and I kind of have to be cleaning it. So I ended up getting this little clear container so it will match like I don't want it on the color. I had other colors, but I just wanted it clear so it would go in my restroom. So I got this random like bar of soap holder. And then I got these two um like bookends, like to kind of put books together because 
again if you watch my last vlog i was vlogging that i want to start getting my son into a routine where we have a bedtime story before he goes to bed every night but i have his books put away in this tub because i had nowhere to like anywhere to like kind of place them and arrange them nicely so i saw these bookends there and they're white again they go with like the color theme that i have here in my room so i figured it'd be nice to like set them here that way it'll be easier for me to just kind of like grab a book and like read them and just put it back i got this for the for that reason i really love this um then i got this uh lotion that i want to try out um i needed a hand cream to just carry my purse and i got this coconut lime i'm not a huge fan of like lemon and like zesty kind of scents but from when i smelled it it smells really fresh and more like coconutty you know i love coconut but i'm not a huge fan of lime but since it smells more coconutty as opposed to lime i picked this one up so i got this and then last but not least i picked up these um facial masks i have been wanting to like take care of my face a lot more but i haven't really like really gotten like okay i'm gonna start using this and put this into this so i need to like really start now so as i was walking i seen these facial masks that they have and actually i didn't get the other one i was gonna get one for the under eye just for like your like the back area for like dark circles and i forgot i just realized i didn't get it so i need to go back for that one depending on how i like these so I got this green tea facial mask. Obviously they're the ones that you put on your entire face. So like you look kind of like a mummy in a way. Um, but those are the type of masks they are. So this is a green tea facial mask. And it soothes and moisturizes your skin. It has vitamin C, E, and green tea extract. And it's for all skin types. So I got the green tea. I got the cucumber facial mask. Which it contains vitamin C, E, and cucumber extract. And this one soothes moisturizes and calms irritated skin and this is the cucumber one and then i got the collagen collagen i think i'm saying that word right collagen facial mask and has vitamin c e again and collagen and this is to reduce fine lines and wrinkles hello and while hydrating the skin and again it's for all skin types so this one i was the one i kind of like aim for the most because fine lines wrinkles like you know, as you get older, you want to start taking care of your skin a lot more. So, I'm definitely going to be trying these out and see how I like them. And maybe I can go back there. I don't really remember the price of them. But, it's Daiso, so everything there is really inexpensive. So, these are the last that I got. And that concludes this little mini Daiso haul, which I hope you guys enjoy. Um, I know that's so random, but I just wanted to share with you guys. It's just really random things. So, again, if you haven't checked out any Daiso Japan stores and you have some around your area, I strongly suggest you guys go and check them out because they have so many stuff and, like, so many cute things that you're, like, you're going to want to bring, like, half of the store with you. So, definitely check it out. And if you have already, take a trip again. Go get yourself some things. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, don't forget to follow me on my social media, on my Instagram, at Fashionista in the City, underscore snapchat ash gas Loom, and my twitter at ashley underscore 24 and oh also don't forget to follow my fashion blog at fashionista in the city i've been doing a lot better at bringing up new looks for you guys like two looks per week around there more or less so definitely keep on the lookout for new looks and what else yeah so that's pretty much it don't forget to give my video a big old thumbs up if you like this video and you want to see more random i don't know shopping hauls that i do randomly here and there don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. And I think that's about it. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.